All right, you guys, we are looking at 108,000 BTU furnace, looking at replacing this, uh, the evapor coil, the supply plenum. Uh, we're gonna look at flaring that out both ways for better flow. The return is uh, the correct size, just um, different dimension than what the air cleaner will allow. Uh, we'll look at scooting this over. We've got about five inches between the water heater and the uh, return drop. We do have a spacer already, so that will still work out for us to put the seven inch cabinet in here. Uh, possibly put it on a base. We'll see what the tonnage is of the AC outside. Uh, if we stick with our standard 80, this is the flue piping that's coming in to here. If they end up changing that out, we'll look at possibly a, just a T and then run a new piping for the water heater. Um, line set comes up. We want to replace this. This runs out and comes over. Uh, just clean all that up and get our new uh, refrigerant through there. And then I'm just going to go over on this other side. Uh, we got an older humidifier. Not sure if it works. They haven't, they don't think they've used it since they've been here. Uh, so older guy may have a little bit of mold growth on that being in the age that it is. Um, and then here's the back of this unit. So plenty of room to flare out that supply plenum.